An artistic tradition of the Renaissance that surely deserves more attention than it generally gets is art made by brilliant women. Like this one here, Propezia de Rossi from Bologna. This is a beautiful filigree coat of arms of the Grassi noble family of Bologna. And uh, it's one of um, the most important works of Properzia de Rossi. She was a specialist in uh, carving uh, uh, fruit stones, especially peaches or uh, plums, like in this case, or apricots. In the middle, there is a um, staurotech which is a reliquary of the Holy Cross with the profiles of uh, the Virgin Mary and uh, of Christ. On this side, we have 12 apostles, while on the other side, we have 12 female saints. We know that uh, she was a specialist in this uh, sort of very miniature carving but she also carved marble, and in the Museum of the Basilica of San Petronius here in Bologna, we've got one of her carvings in, uh, in marble, representing uh, uh, Joseph and Potiphar's wife. Marble, metalwork, miniature fruit stone carving. Propezia even helped design the Basilica's great facade. She could do it all. And over in Florence, in the Pitti Palace, they have this gem of a gem. A hundred faces squeezed onto one cherry stone. That's right, a hundred faces carved into a cherry stone. This isn't art copying the ancients. This is art performing miracles. <laughs> 